woke up and I saw a text from my freshman year roommate and she was like, oh my God, look what Beyonce's wearing. Cowboy fashion soars as Beyonce gets set to drop Renaissance 2. Welcome to the Renaissance. But few knew it was made by a fan. And that hat changed this fan's life. Beyonce continues to break the internet in more ways than one. Music Talkers reports that there's been a spike in interest over cowboy-related gears following Queen Bee's announcement of her forthcoming presumable country album, Renaissance Act 2. <laughs> According to the outlet, searches for cowboy boot and bolo ties skyrocketed by 163% and 566%, respectively following Beyonce's release of Texas Hold'em and 16 Candles. Google searches for cowboy hats also shot up 212.5% after her Super Bowl Verizon commercial, in which she announced the song and her new album, and where she was also wearing a turquoise bolo tie. Sean Diddy Combs accused of sexual harassment by former producer. A former employee of Sean Diddy Combs alleges he sexually assaulted him. According to legal documents obtained by TMZ, Rodney Jones, a former producer and videographer for Diddy, claims that he was sexually assaulted several times by Combs and was subject to unwanted advances by his associates at his direction. According to legal documents obtained by TMZ, Rodney Jones, a former producer and videographer for Diddy, claims that he was sexually assaulted several times by Combs and was subject to unwanted advances by his associates at his direction. Jones, also known as Lil Rod, lived and traveled with Combs from September 2022 to November 2023 while working on Diddy's The Love album, Off The Grid. Jones also alleged that Diddy would grope his genitals, touch his anus, and appear naked in front of him. The producer says he believed Diddy was attempting to groom him into sex and would downplay the alleged assault as horseplay. <laughs> Young Manny on New Wave with Ira. Hi everyone, my name is um, Vicky. I'm the creative costume designer on set for Young Manny music video shoot. A Nigerian-American artist, Aduro Toluwa Okanlawo, aka Young Manny, has released a video for his new single titled Ira. It's your boy Young Manny, man. We on the set of the Ira video shoot, man. Greatest shit ever, man. This shit gonna be turned, man. This shit gonna be everywhere. This shit gonna be global. This shit gonna be worldwide, man. The US based artists traveled all the way to Lagos, Nigeria to make the video in collaboration with a popular director, Anthony Richards of Frizzle and Bizzle Films. This is the first set. We have the dance arena. We have the entrance into the dance arena. And here is the dance floor for everybody to have their party. And then we'll be having the last set. Shot at the old Nepal building, Ijora, the video showcases the talent and the beauty of Nigeria. Hi guys, Shalakwe here, aka Pella. Guys, watch out for Young Manny's Ira. Anticipate, guys. You guys do not want to miss this. <laughs> Thank you. It is a masterpiece that perfectly complements the song, and Frizzle and Bizzle's expectational work in directing the video is evident in the beautiful scenery and captivating choreography. Okay guys, thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. For more news, kindly visit www.southcity.tv.